Okay, I had an accident. I got bit by a Bothrops Aatrox. Um, we need to get to the hospital. Very painful bite, lots of venom. Four foot both rops. He knows that Keith's coming too, right? No. Okay. But we have his number in the phone. Okay. lot of pain radiating from the bite site. A lot of swelling already and some discoloration. I think they went to get one. Okay. You're not allergic this to is about Are you Morphine I have a reaction point. to. You've had dilated before? No. Working about seven days a week. I'm mixing one of the vials here. I don't think I had a real day off except when I went to the hospital last time. measuring the bite to keep track of the swelling progression. You got one more you gotta do that for me. Your arm itself doesn't look that swollen, though. we'll find out when he gets it measured. It's not. It's, it's not. It's staying the same. You got one more. The only one that's increased is number two. One more, Jim. One more. And then your bicep. And then you got the bicep one. <laughs> Hold on. Let me get this belly out of the way so you can get it in there so you can film it. Because I know you don't got the wide angle lens. That's terrible. I, know, I hate to laugh here, but I mean, it's all right. Okay. What are you going to do? I was a he's been, he's been I mean, here he, before. He understands. He's not going to be mad at anybody making fun of him. Oh, I'm not making fun of him. I'm making fun of him. <laughs> you can make fun of anybody you want. I actually think all right. helps. Nothing else you can do. We could all start screaming, but I don't think that would help a whole lot. When in danger or in doubt, run a circle, scream and shout. That's not my idea. <laughs> so you said you were a paramedic? Yeah, he was. Up in Ohio. So you know the old, if you don't know the rhythm, shock it till you know it? You can go if you have another one. Yeah. Yeah. On the side here, you can see the discoloration. Mostly red at this point. Bring it up. I don't know. All right, Jim. Tell me how it happened first. I was tubing a four-foot both rops atrox, and it actually struck above the tube and hit me in the wrist. I had to actually physically pull it off me because it wouldn't let go. All right. So you were holding the end of the tube, and the snake struck over, over your tube. hand, actually. Even. Yep. Here's the bite site right now. It bled a lot initially when I first, when I first pulled it off. It bled a lot initially? Yeah. That's not surprising. It isn't bleeding now. We're at about uh, not quite an hour and a half out. You've had three vials of Bioclone Tri pushed, and we're working on seven more vials IV right now. And you've had some pain meds. Yeah, the pain was intense from the time of the bite. And it's intensified. And the pain was even making me a little bit in the Benadryl, making me a little drowsy, but the pain's still there. It's very intense. 
um, probably the most painful envenomation I've ever felt. And, but it's, it's very close to the radial nerve, I believe, and that may be intensifying the pain a little bit. Well, here we are at about two hours after the bite. These are the two fang marks. So this is actually from a maxillary teeth. There's the bottom jaw. The swelling is right about here right now. Turn your palm up. There's the swelling. Now we're at about, oh well, almost five hours now after the bite. You see the swelling. All right, let me walk around. Lots of swelling. Lots of pain. And it hurts a lot. This is, uh, I don't know, about 9 o'clock at night. It's only so eight. About, <laughs> eight like it's, it's about nine, nine hours afterwards. <laughs> so it's about five o'clock the next day. You can see the swelling's all the way up into the upper arm now too. And we have a little bit of discoloration. Can you turn it or do you need me to come around? Yes, it's fine. I'll come yeah. around. Got some discoloration there on the thumb. That's fang marks right here. Those are the fang marks. Yeah, I'll just lay it over there, it's fine. Okay. That's great. Hi. All right, it is. Saturday, so this is four days out, I think. And the swelling has gone down in the fingers and, and in the arm. You can see the arm is going down, but we're still having a lot of swelling in the hand. And you can see this isn't real pretty right here. So we're not exactly sure what to make of the the swelling, we just have to kind of wait and see. We are on antibiotics, and the pain is still really intense. And we're on ketamine now. And it's up to my Neurontin to 900. Yeah, lots of Neurontin and ketamine.